I'm kind of glad the sun went down. Yeah, it feels much better. Yeah, I cooked my brain earlier. Mm -hmm. That's when they were making us move all the equipment out of the pint. They're redoing the whole inside of the place to make it this new. Yeah. Yeah. You guys know the uh, Main Street Tavern in Broken Arrow? Yeah. They have one in Claremore, too. They bought out the pine. Where I work at is the pine on Cherry Street. It's now going to be the Main Street Tavern location on Cherry Street. Oh, really? It won't open until sep September, probably. But I'm, I'm helping as a, a general labor guy, kind of moving all this stuff out, all these tables and stuff. Yeah. We're cleaning everything and then hauling it out, putting it on a trailer and putting it in a storage building so we can scrub the whole inside of the kitchen and repaint everything. Yeah, it's kind of a fancy bar pub, real thing. Yeah. Get out of the way, there's people. You're all painted. All right. All right. Go. Yeah, that's kind of what, that's why I got cooked in the heat. Because usually I'm inside in the air. But I was. Yeah, you're a little bit sunburned. Yeah, it got my forehead, I think. Yeah. I kept running in and out, and then we were scrubbing some of the tables and spraying them down outside. Pretty good for a little kid. Yeah, he's never done this. Yeah, I wish he could get on the skateboard. He just doesn't know how to skate. Yeah, he doesn't know how to do a skateboard yet. Between the kids on the scooters and then on the skateboard, they'll catch on pretty quick. They'll be doing both before the summer's over, I bet. Every day I have to get him out. He freaks out if I don't take him outside. As soon as he wakes up, he's like, Yeah, it wouldn't be safe. Yeah, and it's like, take me outside. And I can't be out the heat like that because I get all this shit. You know, you can go to the skate park at Riverside until 11 o'clock. They have the lights on. Oh, really? Yeah. They'll, they'll wait till right about night time and then they kick on. I don't know if someone's manually turning them on or if it's on a timer or something. Mm -hmm. Darling, get out of the way. It'd be a little bit cooler in the evening time. Outside, huh? outside, and there's not a whole lot. Of, it's like I don't know what to. I get like frustrated because I don't know. There's not a whole lot to do out here, and we have a, we have a sidewalk a, or a driveway. There is a per parking lot right down the street, but I don't have. You know, my oldest doesn't live with us, and it's just me and him. We could build a, a quarter pipe road. If you had a sidewalk or a driveway. There's a parking, a church parking lot at the end. And there is a uh, driveway. Yeah, that's what we did at my mom and pops when we were little, uh, through junior high, even all the way up into high school almost. We'd just build a quarter pipe ramp like that big red one, yeah. and we'd put it right there on the sidewalk or at the bottom of the driveway. And sometimes we didn't make them that big. We'd see these little, the red and the blue one going up to that platform. Yeah, I know. We'd but make a little one like that. They had little one. Like uh -huh. My friends had a little one, and they would come off the driveway, put it at the end. We could make some little ramps like that pretty quick. A little kid crap or something. He has no mentor. He has guys around him, nobody. Just me and him. I feel bad for him because he just doesn't have the... He needs, like, some type of male influence, something. Just kind of whenever you get a chance, remember to come up on Saturday when you can. That's what I'm going to do. And I know that... He really needs it. It's... Oh, oh shit. Yeah. Yeah. Ouch. I heard that. Shit. Oh, that probably hurt. Oh, man. Yeah, that was a good slam. I saw one other guy do that earlier, too. Straight. But all his weight went right on the floor. 